This is a lovely little question. We're asked to find the area of this circle and it seems that we're not given very much information because all we have is that it goes through the point 5, 5. In actual fact, we are given other information as well. We're given that the y-axis is a tangent and we're also given that the x-axis is a tangent. What we're going to do is we're going to use symmetry to uh, solve this. So we're going to draw the line y equals x, which goes through uh, here. Um, and y equals x also, by symmetry, goes through the centre of the circle. And let's call that a a. That's the line y equals x by symmetry, which means that by symmetry, that distance there is a, and this distance here is a, radius of the, uh, of the circle. Um, and let's just change the colour here. Um, so uh, let's change it to uh, red, yeah, why not? Okay, so um, uh, we're going to now draw this triangle here, which is a right angle triangle, and let's call that B, and by symmetry that is also B, and this obviously is the radius of the circle A, and we can see that A plus B equals 5. Um, so by Pythagoras, uh, let's move back to uh, black pen, by Pythagoras we have that A squared equals B squared plus B squared, i.e. a squared equals 2b squared, i.e. we have that b equals a over root 2. And given that we know that a plus b equals 5, because that's uh, where the coordinates are here, we have that a plus a over root 2 equals 5, i.e. we have that a equals 5 root 2 over root 2 plus 1. OK, so now that we know that what A is, which is the radius, we can work out the area. So the area is pi times A squared, which equals pi times 25 times 2 over root 2 plus 1 squared, which equals 50 pi over root 2 plus 1 squared. That's the area. Now, just as a matter of interest, if this point wasn't 5, 5, let's imagine it was C, C, and we can generalise this result because that would be C, that would be C, that would be C, that would be C squared. So if for a general point C, C, the area would be equal to C squared times 2 pi over root 2 plus 1 squared. So it's a lovely little question, that one. Uh, if you found this useful, please uh, like it by uh, pressing the little thumbs up button um, and subscribe to the Gressy Academy YouTube channel. Thank you.